Hello, Andy from Mind Apples here. And today's Mind Apple comes from Naomi, who says that one of the things she does that's good for her mind is to remind herself that she only needs to be good enough. We put a lot of pressure on ourselves, particularly if we're high in conscientiousness, if you're the kind of person who thinks there's a correct way for things to be done, who cares a lot about details. It's easy to start criticising the things that you do and feeling that, that nothing is ever quite as good as you'd hoped it would be. But resist this, because actually, a lot of the time, uh, the things that we do are perfectly good enough, and other people really like them, get value from them, and it's only because we've paid so much care and attention that we see these flaws that other people can't even spot. So try to notice when you're tipping into perfectionism. It's not about having lower standards or not caring about when things are right or not. It's about how you feel when things aren't perfect. Do you feel that uh, the perfection is a nice to have, but you can live with things as they are, or do you find that you're beating yourself up about it? So try to have a good relationship with things turning out in an unexpected way and allow yourself a bit of freedom to improvise. Maybe the thing that you had in your head isn't as good as the thing that happened to come out. So try to remember that. Not always easy, uh, certainly. There may be things that you get wrong. I'm sure I've made plenty of mistakes in this video, but hey, it's good enough and I hope you enjoy it. So thanks very much for that, Naomi.